Hail to St. Mary, her glory and her power, carry her fame to the end of the earth, singing her praises wherever we go, telling all around us the joy that we know right here at St. Mary, St. Mary's our own, her blue and her white ever dearer have grown, so SMA. We sing to you, we hail you, St. Mary, St. Mary's our own. My name is Julie O'Keefe McGee, and I'm a proud graduate of St. Mary the Springs Academy, class of 1956. But before 1956 came around, there was a lot of learning going on in the east side of Columbus around the springs that were along Allen Creek. And actually, things really started way down in Kentucky when those sisters came up in about 1830 to Perry County and started their academy. And they did well for about 30 some years until 1866 and there was a horrendous fire. And the good sisters had to decide where were they going to go. Well, as it happened, two of the sisters in the congregation had a father by the name of Theodore Leonard. And Mr. Leonard had a business in Columbus along Allen Creek. Let's look at some of the pictures that we have here in the St. Mary's Academy room here in the Jubilee Museum. Mother Vincentia, she was one of those strong women that knew how to run an establishment. The school was primarily a boarding school for many, many years.
when we graduated from the academy. I can remember that we all, now the dress would vary slightly from year to year, but it would usually be a long white dress. In my case, we had little tiny flowers on it. And we would have a fancy breakfast and we would have our picture taken. Look at these two outfits. These would have been around the time of 1910-1911. The dances that we had. I'll never forget my date for the autumn dance was shaking in his boots because when we went to the dance the sisters who taught us all lined up in a row and we had to take our date down the line and introduce them to each of the sisters because that's what a proper St. Mary's girl could do. This is Hamilton Hall which was the dining hall and back up here is where we had to line up to introduce our dates. And this is where we had our graduation breakfast. I have fond memories of this uniform. When I started as a freshman at St. Mary of the Springs, the skirt on my uniform came down to my knees. But by the time I graduated, it must have been all those good lunches we had at school. It was about mid-thigh. Sisters did not like to see us playing our field hockey games with shorter legs. sisters sure tried really hard to give all of the girls who passed through their care not only a good intellectual education but ties to their spirituality. This little statue was given to each of the members of the last class, the 1966 class, and it was a gift and it was a statue of the Blessed Virgin Mary and they would always revere it and treat it with much care and reverence. It should be kept upright at all times. For many people in the class, they set this little statue right down next to their desk. Three, four, five minutes passed, and an apple came rolling down. The statues that must always be kept upright and revered lasted upright about five minutes. The St. Charles boys used to come to St. Mary's after school, and it was a nice spring day. We were in study hall. That was our last class of the day. We usually got our books and left right after that. But the St. Charles boys were there. It so happened that my future husband was out there, who I dated at the time. So I thought, well, I'm just going to go out this window. So out I go. Standing down there was our beloved sister, Louis Bertrand. And I thought, oh, brother, I'm going to be in trouble. But she looks at me and she goes, my lips are sealed. So I thought that was so sweet of her. I could have been in big, big trouble. To be a St. Mary's girl was an honor and a privilege because you carried your education and your spirituality with you always. And thank you.
so proudly ring out while we sing out hail 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 so proudly ring out while we sing out hail 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 won't you ring them 